Have you ever been to the Grand Canyon or seen photos of it? You probably noticed that the eroded walls of the canyon are formed of numerous layers of rock. When you look at a cliff or a rock face, you might see a uniform face of rock. More often, like the Grand Canyon, the cliff will have several different layers. If two adjacent layers of rock are missing an interval in geological time, geologists call the surface of contact between them an unconformity. Unconformities are common in sequences of sedimentary rocks, where a much younger layer lies directly on top of an older layer. In the Grand Canyon, you can observe that the unconformity exists where a much younger layer lies on one formed much earlier. Here, the top layer is a billion years younger than the layer beneath it. This period of time is so significant that geologists call it the Great Unconformity. There are three different kinds of unconformities. An angular unconformity is formed by a process that begins when sedimentary rocks are deposited into horizontal layers. These rocks are then deformed, tilting due to forces in Earth's interior. Next, weathering erodes the tilted rocks. Finally, another episode of sedimentation deposits additional horizontal layers on top of the angled layers. Another type of unconformity is a disconformity. A disconformity results when a new layer of rock is laid down on top of the eroded surface of a much older rock. Both layers of rock are horizontal. Because the layers have the same orientation, a disconformity can be harder to recognize in the field than other types of unconformity. A disconformity may be evident only if the rocks are dated, using fossils or radioactive dating. A nonconformity arises when sedimentary rocks are deposited over igneous or metamorphic rocks. This type of formation represents significant change in the geological environment from volcanism to periods dominated by deposition sedimentation. A nonconformity is relatively easy to recognize since it is distinguished by younger sedimentary rocks above older igneous rock. Unconformities help geologists to discover episodes of volcanism, uplift, erosion, and deposition.